What's going on, little fella? That one. Yeah, look at it. She's yeah, just it's like. It's called playing possum. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, because so I'm looking at it, probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah and they heard us moving. All right, all right. Just, uh, I'll, I'll go ahead talking to you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all right. Like a I, I, uh, yeah, not unless you know we block eye contact for long enough. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, when I was at the PA, there was um, I used to feed like three of them and every, every night. Oh. I'd, I'd get bananas and whatever, and there we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What? Oh no! That bloody light going on isn't the best. No, yeah. Maybe not a good one. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, like I was feeding three of them at the hospital there every night. And, um, you know, I'd get a banana and break it up and um, put it up on the fence paling. And, uh, you know, they'd all come in. And there was a cat there as well. And the cat would sit under this bush every night. No, no. So I was like, this one night I'm sitting there, and I'm like, looking at this sort of cat, I'm like, is it a cat? I went right up to it, it didn't take off or anything. Yeah. No, nah, it's just sat there under this tree for hours. And then at about probably 10 o'clock at night, I, um, one of the guys that works at the PA, he's come in and the cat has just come out and just come to life. And old mate's coming, he's like, hey mate, how you going? And I'm like, oh good bloke, good, good, yeah, yeah. we got talking. And um, I'm like, this cat loves you, dude. Like, this cat's following you. And he's like, oh, yeah, yeah. I feed her every night. Like, she's one of my old cats. I'm like, really? Like, what, what, what's the go? Like, yeah, what, what, you know, what, what, what happened? Like, yeah. why, why um, do you feed her? And he's like, mate, I've had her, like, initially he had a cat and a dog at his house. Yeah. His cat got pregnant and had kittens. And um, he was trying to home the kitten, the kittens out, to to um, oh, yeah. you know to someone to a nice home, and uh, no one came for these kittens. Oh. So he was like, a, you know, I don't want to put this yeah. cats down, yeah. you know. So he took them to the vet. There was four cats that didn't get taken. He took all of those cats to the vet, got them all desexed. Yeah. Then he took them to work, and he kept them at work. And this was one of the cats. He, this is a nine-year-old cat, right? So he had this cat that he was feeding. I'm like, and I thought it was just one. I'm like, dude, like you're you're a nice bloke, man. Like, who does that? You know yeah. what I mean? Like, who? Yeah. You know? Yeah, I just good. thought this guy's lovely, you know. And he's got a twin brother. They were they've been working. He's been working there for like 17 years. Yeah, and right. um, I'm like, shit, man. That, that that's that's awesome, dude. Like. It's good to know that there's, you know, people like yourself around. And um, then and he didn't even tell me that there was another three of them at the hospital. And I've gone down to because I used to go out for a cigarette. And um, I've gone found this other place to go and have a cigarette on the hospital grounds. And I'm there and these three cats are buddy, like, he's come out and these three cats are following him. And I'm like, dude, like, how come this one is sort of, you know, they're all from the same litter. And he, and he's like, oh, I don't know what happened, but Gravo was the one cat that I saw that was his name. He's like, oh, Gravo didn't get along with the other three sisters. And um, so they sort of ostracised her and kicked her out of the camp. And, um, and I was just like, dude, and these other cats would come up to him and, and he's like, I'll tell you something funny about Graver. I'm like, what's that? He's like, for the first year I had her, well, what did you say? He was like, when she had her original fight with the other sisters, yeah. um, she left and he never saw her for five years. And then all of a sudden, Graver's just rocked back up, up yeah. at this different location five years later. And he'd been feeding her for like three years. I'm like, really? He's like, yeah. Jeez, so, so he's like, I, I don't know, you know, where Gravo's gone, but Gravo's lived a whole other life in like five yeah. years. I wonder <laughs> if it was a patient to take that home. And then, who knows? Yeah, who knows? Right? <laughs> who knows? Like, 
So yeah, I was like, man, that's really cool. Yeah, it's a cool story. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's good. 